This is the passion, drama and action that defines the A1 GP World Cup of Motorsport. GP is the first and only motorsport series in which nations have the opportunity to compete on equal terms with identical technology. This means that every race, every event and the championship is determined by the bravery, skill, ingenuity and brilliance of the competitors and their teams. It is a true World Cup that is celebrated with flags, colour and anthems to be shared by everyone. From its inception, A1GP has inspired business leaders and politicians with its global message. Of the possibility for people to compete and yet be one humanity. I think that's a very important part of this project. It is indeed a very unique privilege for me to be here to be launching this A1 team Pakistan. No other sporting event brings together so frequently national pride, confidence and sporting ability. Unique carbon fibre race cars are built by specialist manufacturers Lola and racing slicks are provided by Cooper tyres. The 550 horsepower 3.4 litre V8 engine is built by Zytec and is mated to a six speed paddle shift gearbox. But no traction control, it's all about the driver's skill. Gaining the approval of motor racing stars past and present. I think the concept is very good. It's a winter series which nobody has yet. The car looks very interesting. So I think everything looks done very professionally. Uh, at the end of the day, you're looking for, for uh, similarities between the cars and uh, whoever wins uh, is the best. So I think this is a great idea. With race weekends taking place in five continents, a dedicated logistics team transports these machines from Europe to Asia, Australasia, Africa, America and back again. We're talking 50 cars travelling around the world, equipment for teams. We have one mechanic with each team to keep control of the spec of the cars. A1 GP World Cup of Motorsport truly achieved its main aim to introduce motorsport to new markets and new sponsors. The first A1 GP season saw eight nations recording race wins and teams from such emerging motorsport nations as Indonesia, China, Pakistan, Lebanon and India. A1GP is proud to be inclusive, global and to reach out to the family audiences that proudly support their national sporting heroes. Whilst providing first class coverage of the motor racing, A1GP's TV broadcast seeks most fundamentally to entertain. We had our television pictures all over the world. Um, over 130 countries ended up taking the actual series programs from as far east as China, all the way through to the other side of the world, America. The coverage was, was quite extensive. I think we accomplished what we set out to do, and there's more to come. There certainly is, with innovative ideas coming this season to provide unparalleled coverage. I think it's been a great year for A1. It's completely surpassed my expectations, I mean, in every way. In my sincere opinion, uh, it, it is the best thing that ever happened in, in motor racing. The, the, I think the key element, which is so much different to any other sports, uh, other sports, is that this is all about the whole and not about the individual. Of course, beginning in, 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 in branch house was very impressive with the full house and all that. But I think the start has been much more positive than anybody would have uh, expected. I love the concept of A1 Grand Prix, the Grand Prix of Nations. This is not a driver's championship. Each team represents their country, racing in their national colours. Over 20 different countries are represented. And although all are fiercely competitive, there is a great camaraderie between the nations. 
A1 GP drivers are a mixture of experience and youthful enthusiasm. For many of the up and coming young drivers, the A1 GP car is by far the fastest challenge they have yet faced. They compete against established names from Formula One, Indy Racing League, Champ Car and DTM, all with reputations to maintain and points to prove. But only in A1 GP do they compete for their country. There are races within races, national and regional pride to be won, whether fighting for a place on the podium or a place towards the back of the field. The A1 GP concept features the unique ability to bring nations and business together and was founded with a sound business model. The teams are franchised to the seat holders who then employ drivers and are free to bring in their own sponsors and design their own liveries. It is the first motorsport series created with the intention of representing over 80% of the world's population. The concept of A1 GP é muito alucinante, né? Porque você reúne é, 25 equipes em 25 países é, numa competição onde os carros são idênticos e isso pode fazer com que é, o campeonato seja emocionante do início ao fim. The camaraderie ship down the pit lane. Although you have 25 different cultures, nations, everyone gets on. I think it obviously it shows you that people get on from all sides of the world, no matter what the differences are. That makes it very, very different. The competition is definitely still there. Everyone wants to go back home and say they've done well. But amongst the teams, yeah, I think if you walk up and down, you can feel the friendship. You can feel the guys are excited to be back. They're excited that they're going to spend the next six months together competing. And obviously always keeping in mind that they're competing for their nation. But in terms of competition in the pits and so on, you find that it's one one people of the world, that's it. A1 Grand Prix has found the right balance between technology and competition. It has created racing packed with overtaking and incidents and is the most exciting open wheel series seen in the last decade. Attacking front for the lead! Final lap! Can he get around? Oh no! It's on the inside of the collider level and over and over again into the gravel. Oh, India's hit pack is done! Can you believe it? The two great rival nations have collided. Three cars are pressed as they come down to touch oh, with PK. That's PK has touched Japan. And with that, France has won the World Cup of motorsport. It's a dominant performance. This is A1GP World Cup of Motorsport.